Hello, Living Hope Church. I want to give you a few updates, one just in general, but specifically also to this coming Sunday. Uh, first of all, just in general, thank you to everyone who is uh, helping us make these in-person worship services week in and week out such a wonderful experience. We've been able to do these in a healthy and safe manner, and so thank you to all who are serving. Also, thank you to everyone who's continued to join us online for our live stream each week. We want everyone to feel comfortable with the way they're able to, to proceed through these times right now. So uncertain for many of us. And uh, I don't want anyone to feel left out or left behind. So we're going to continue to offer our online live stream each and every Sunday. And if you need anything and you're not here in person with us, please continue to let us know how we can pray for you and any needs that you might have as we move through this time. And as we started back in March with all this, uh, we talked about from the book of James, the importance of extending grace to one another. And now as we've transitioned into the book of Ephesians, one of Paul's highlights in this book is that we need to bear with one another in love. And uh, the, just that, that the subject of unity in Christ is there as well. And so we want to continue to, to uh, just press into those things and allow the Lord to work in our hearts in that way as we grow together and be, are being built up as the body of Christ. And so as we move into this Sunday, we are having one service at 10 o'clock. There might have been a little bit of confusion with our, our weekly email this week, but I want to clarify that one service at 10 o'clock uh, we want to see what this looks like and what this works like for us this coming Sunday. We'll also have a cookout as well following that service. There'll be prepackaged cookies and chips and bottles of water and condiments. And then we will be able to serve with gloves and tongs, um, hamburgers and hot dogs and buns and all those things to be able to do this in a safe manner. So everyone's welcome after the service on Sunday to stay with us. We'll be spread out in the parking lot. Uh, so that we can, again, contain, continue to do all these things that we're doing in a safe manner. And so we would love for you to join us at 10 o'clock this coming Sunday. And then also after that uh, Sunday um, service, we will have a cookout out in the parking lot this Sunday, July 5th. And uh, people have asked, are we going to continue with one service? We're going to evaluate after this coming Sunday to see whether we want to continue with one service at 10 o'clock or go back to two services. Uh, so be uh, watching for announcements on that. This Sunday, we'll also have our live stream at 10 o'clock with the one service that we're doing. So want to make sure everyone's aware of those things. We're just continuing to look in and proceed uh, as we move forward into the weeks ahead. Uh, some have asked about children's ministry, and we are in the process of planning that out. So step one is us looking at whether we're going to be in one or two services, and then we will probably do a tiered approach in opening back up children's ministry. Uh, Lindsay Williams has been doing a great job of contacting our volunteers and seeing who is uh, available right now, and that allows us to know how many classes we can open, what that looks like. Our current plan is to open up the, the nursery rooms around the Genesis area first, then move into Clubhouse later, and then move into Pipeline after that. So it'll probably be a three-tiered approach. Again, all these things are subject to change, and uh, we're just moving through these one step at a time. We'll keep you informed about everything. And I hope you're doing well. Again, if anyone needs anything, please let us know. You can call, email, and uh, our church uh, staff and pastors, we would love to serve you in any way that we can. So if you have a need or if you have a prayer need, please let us know. And on that note, every Thursday evening, we're holding a Facebook Live prayer meeting. It's Thursday evenings at 7 o'clock on our Facebook page. Uh, if you haven't been able to join us in with that, uh, come on and join us in prayer as uh, we connect together in prayer. You can uh, have your prayer requests right there in the comment section. It's a great time to gather together and uh, pray for one another. So hope you're doing well. Hope to see you soon and uh, have a great rest of your week.